Welcome to Bugsplat. In this video, we're going to do a quick walkthrough of the Bugsplat web application. When you log into Bugsplat, the first page you see is the dashboard. The dashboard allows you to monitor the stability of your application over time. The crashes page displays a list of all the crashes posted for your application and provides powerful searching and grouping tools. To see more details for a specific crash, click the link in the crash ID column. The crash page provides a detailed view of crash data and includes a fully symbolicated stack trace. The crash page also allows you to push crash reports from Bugsplat to your defect tracking tool. The summary page displays crashes grouped by function name and line number and allows you to quickly see which crashes are happening most often. Click the link in the stack key column to see a list of all the crashes for a specific function name and line number. The key crash page displays crashes grouped by a common stack key. By default, the stack key is the function name and line number at the top of the crashing threads call stack. You can group crashes by a different function name and line number by using the call stack explorer button. To integrate your application with Bugsplat, click the life raft at the top right of the screen. The life raft will direct you to our documentation where we provide information on how to configure Bugsplat on various platforms. If you have any questions or would like to provide feedback, you can contact us using the chat bubble located at the bottom of the screen. You can also email us at support at bugsplat.com. Thanks for using Bugsplat.